Even my horses want the Grub Terra. Crazy horses. Man, I got some crazy hair today. <laughs> Andy agrees. Man, she's really curious about that. Okay guys, welcome back to Littlefoot Ranch. And if you're new here, welcome. I am Rebecca. And today's video is just, it's all about chicken snacks, really. Well, not all about chicken snacks and not about how I feed them, but one snack in specific that could totally, completely change y'all's chicken self. Okay, y'all. And so, you know, ever since I started chicken keeping, I have heard about Grub Terra. Let me turn the bag around so y'all can get a better look. And everything, and I have always wanted to try them. But honestly, and you know, let me know if you guys want a video on how we completely feed our chickens because it's actually just not something interruptions by dogs oh geez homestead life be right back. oh my gosh they've never even had it and they're already so excited they said mom's here mom's here mom's here she's got something Okay, I just came into the chicken run. Hopefully it'll be a little quieter over here between Indy being demanding and the Merlin barking. And now we got Rooster's crowing, so yeah, no. But <clears throat> I have always wanted to try Grub Terra with my flock. And now this is not gonna be a video on all that, how we feed them. Although if you guys want a video on how we feed our girls and our roos, let me know. Um, we do not just give them just random bags of grain. There's actually a lot that goes into how we feed them. So if you guys are interested in a full-on chicken feed video, let me know. And I will get that in the works. But anyway, today is about this. I am so jazzed, y'all, about Grub Terra. I have, like I said, been wanting to try it forever and ever and ever with our girls. And I mean, y'all asked for more of the animals. Y'all are getting it. I was doing a mealworm farm for our girls and that just, I didn't enjoy it. I actually stopped a, lot, a while back in doing it because I just was not enjoying it. It was hard to keep up with. And so we just went to, <coughs> sorry, Cletus. Um, we just went to buying dried mealworms and implementing that into their feed. And so when Grub Terra reached out, I was all too ecstatic 
to say heck yes. So let me just read some of the benefits off to y'all. Scrub Terra Black Soldier Fly Larva. This is our first bag. You guys are going to get to see their reactions. And look at all that. Produces stronger eggshells. Keep feathers healthy. Farm raised. Oh yeah, 75% more calcium than mealworms. Great for chickens, reptiles, fish, and birds. Sweet. Let's flip this bad boy over. Let you guys get a look-see at the back. And read that. Crabs are not for human consumption. Check out that. Crude protein, 34%. Fat, 32%. Fiber, 12%. Calcium. Check that out. Phosphorus and moisture and ash. Nice. Ingredients, just that. Black soldier fly larva. That's it. Nothing else. And it's produced right here in the good old USA. Yeah. USA, folks. Even better. So, let's open these up and let's see how the girls and the guys like them. So, to help me finish out the video, I recruited some help. So, one second. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. <laughs> Cletus can't wait. He's so excited. There we go. Oh yeah, they're checking it out. They're checking it out. Yum. Check it out. They're going for it. Oh yeah, they're all coming in. They're all coming in. Look at them all coming in. Here we go, darling. Come on. Daddy Galaxy. But y'all, clearly they love it. I am so excited to see how adding these black soldier fly larvae from Gutterra into their diet will impact our flock. I am sure it's going to be way for the better. It makes me feel so good knowing that I'm doing my best to feed my girls and my roos and I'm to the feeding them to the best of my ability and you know you want your eggs that you feed your family to be as nutritious as they possibly can be and it just you know knowing the source that they're coming from knowing that they're right here from the good old USA and everything like that just makes me feel good from Grabterra. I am so excited that we got to try them out and I can't wait to see the overall impact Cindy. the overall impact that they have on the flock as an overall as a whole I can't wait I know like the benefits are absolutely awesome that are listed on the packaging and the nutritional and profile for it and you know um, I mentioned before if you guys wanted a video on all around how we feed them just let me know and I can get that video in the works for you guys but um, I am so excited to see just how much of a difference this particular snack that we will now be for now on implementing into their diet will just overall impact. I'm sure the benefits are going to be awesome. I mean, they're chickens and they just, you know, they got to have their protein and they know what's good and what's not. You know what I'm saying? Clearly, Grub Terra is a win. So I am so excited that we got to try it. A huge shout out and a huge thank you to Grub Terra for reaching out. My flock thanks you. My girls thank you. I thank you. So, okay guys, well I hope you enjoyed today's video and hanging out with me and Indy and the chickens. I am sorry about all the relentless noisiness going on <laughs> of the homestead of Merlin barking and just everything, the roosters crowing. Yeah, you know, it's the adventures of homesteading. But I really am excited about to see about seeing, about how, seeing how implementing this into their diet will affect them. I am sure it's going to be for the better. The horses came by and spooked the chickens. 
never a dull moment. But anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video. And until next time, take care and have a beautiful, fantastic day. Bye.